hey guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to be doing a ladder stitch again it's going to look something like this so let's go ahead and get started so i do have my wire threaded already as you guys know i use size d thread i use size 10 beading needle so let's go ahead and get started it's the same exact way like you start a regular ladder stitch. I did do a video on it. It's the same exact way. So we, from the back of the earring right here, so we're gonna go ahead and tie a knot. One knot. And then we're gonna go ahead and do a double knot. One, two. Okay, then right here, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and pick up four, four beads, whatever color you like. So right now we're working with black. So let's go ahead and pick up four black. The same exact way we were doing before. Pulling all the way through. So the tail did get caught up in it so we're going to go ahead and take that out and then we're going to go ahead and go up through two beads and just like that and then we're going to go ahead and repeat the same process we're going to go ahead and pick up two beads and then go on the other side go down down up through the two beads the same exact way as I showed you guys on the other video we're gonna do the same exact thing but this one instead of doing triangles we're gonna be just picking up two beads at a time just like this so this is how it looks let's see if I can zoom in a little bit two beads go on the other side of the hoop and go under then we're gonna go ahead and pull it through so I do keep my finger right there so I can hold the thread and then we're gonna go ahead and go back up and like I said we're gonna go ahead and repeat the same process all the way around to this side so i'll go ahead and be back okay so now we are at the beginning of the earring so in other words at the end so i'm going to go ahead and pick up two more beads this will be my last one for this So you guys can definitely do the same technique also with like more than two beads. You guys can do it with three beads, four beads, whatever you guys prefer, whatever you guys want to do. So I'm showing you guys with two beads because it'll be a lot easier for you guys to learn. So now since we're at the last part, I'm going to show you guys how to add the sequence, right? So the beginning right here, as you can see, I didn't add no, no bead. I just went ahead with the sequence. So let's go ahead and pick up one of the little sequins, right? Let's go ahead and pick up a black bead. I mean, a black sequence and then a clear bead. Pick up another sequence, then a little one, then one black bead. So right here what we're gonna do is like I said we went ahead and got our last two went through it like we were doing all you know before then I went ahead and picked up my sequence and this is how it looks so now right here what I'm gonna get what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and tighten it a bit so I'm gonna go ahead and skip so we're gonna actually go through the thread let me show you 
the thread. See it? So we're going to knot through this one. One, two, the third. Through the third thread. That's the one that we're going to go through. Just like this. Just like that. get it and then right here what we're gonna do is we're gonna go up through the bead like this then we're gonna go ahead and repeat the same process we're gonna go ahead and pick up our sequence whatever we decide to get okay let me get all the stuff I need This one, this one, this, and one bead. So let me show you again how it looks. So this is how it looks. And like I said, we're going to go through the third one. One, two, three. So we're going to go through this one right here. Pull all the way through then right here we're gonna go up through that bead we put the bead we put on with the sequence we're gonna go up through the bead then we're gonna go ahead and just repeat the same process all the way through okay so now we are finally at the end Let's go ahead and pick up the beads that we need. I mean, the sequins that we need. Hmm. Let me see how this one. So I actually went ahead and got a bead at the end too. That's weird. Okay. Okay, now I know what I did. I think I went up through this. So right here, so I went through the last thread, right? So I went up through the last thread right here. So we're gonna go up through the last bead as well. And then right here, we're gonna go down through the last two beads. just like this and then at the beginning you how you had a tail right here so we're gonna go ahead and tie this and the sequence thread together let's go one knot and let's go ahead and do a double knot just like that and then right here well, I'm gonna go back up through the beads again the two the last two I'm gonna go up through the last two again. Let me see if that plank works. Just like that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and tighten it right here. Just pull my thread through and then I'm gonna go ahead and cut it off. And then I'm gonna go. Can I lay down on your bed? Go ahead. Okay. And then I'm gonna go ahead and go through the top like this. And then right here, I'm gonna go ahead and cut off this thread, this sequin thread, right there. And then this part right here, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this one off as well. And then the rest of this thread, I'm gonna go ahead and burn it. But yeah, there it is, guys. Look how beautiful it came out. So don't forget to subscribe, guys. Also like and comment. Also share, guys. Yeah, I think that um, sharing would also be so cool. Alright, guys. Until again. Bye.